how would I make this intro better? Executor review, no drum roll needed, it is QEX. We'll try our best to download it and see how well it goes. Link for tides is super simple, you just do it. Who do you want to fight for you? Uh, I know, tough decision. Alright, it seems like I don't have to necessarily download it. I think I will fuck you. Also, please do not comment that executors I review are adware. Just skip all. Take a chill pill. We're given more ads. KiwiX.Roar. Okay, gamers, some things are still loading. While it's loading, I got a question for the day. When's the last time you shit yourself? Already, everything is loaded in. Unfortunately, I don't think the executor is being recorded by my recorder of the PC. Um, Well, that sucks because KiwiX is really good for its uh, visual representation, I'd say. This is what it should look like if it did download successfully. I'll try and edit it in there. Uh, if not, suck toes. One of the best games in existence, to be honest. All right, we need to go with uh, Thor. You'll see why in a second. I've been practicing this game lately to make a world record. Pretty cool shit, I know. Anyways, furthermore, using KiwiX, we executed a universal script, Infinity Yield. Basically, it makes us the elite of Roblox society. Obviously, you can find yourself some better scripts and try executing them. For now, it's just going to be me talking with infinite yield. I know fly should work. Yeah, fly definitely works. A uh, very cool thing about this game is that you can steal other people's items, like this Iron Man gloves. That one's kind of useless, though. Let me grab a better one. Yes, this one is the real game changer. I'm currently flying, so he can't really fling me, but I can fling him back. Which is, uh, I think is funny. All right, what do we have here? Oh, hell yeah. Now I can grow. Don't be surprised. This is the new quality of Marvel. Now I'm really big. Oh god, I'm, I'm an easy target because I'm too big. There's not much else stuff here. Again, you can use your own script. Don't mind me. Uh, yeah, more about the game. What you can do is, uh, what happened to the loadout pad? Aha, finally. Now that's what we were looking for. It's gotten to a point where developers have to do paid ads within games. Now, you must buy lightning gun for this sword, you see. The lightning bolt sucks. It's like granny ass level weaponry. What you really want is this for five whole grand. Yeah, this game really speaks for itself when a modern weapon is far worse than a medieval weapon. Flashbang. Oh, fuck. Other than the fact that this sword deals about 100 damage per hit. Let me give you a demonstration. That wasn't good enough, I have to do another one. It also has an ability to teleport. If you press E, you can just teleport inside anything. Like, how cool is that? And you can loot other people's items, even if they have a roof. Now, obviously, this item is worthless if you have exploits, but, you know, just saying. Dang, he knows the tricks. I think Roblox bought a company called Bitefront or something. It's like an anti-cheat. Now, I won't lie. I thought they always had an anti-cheat. I just thought it was really bad, but apparently they didn't. So, yeah, that kind of sucks. Will Kiwi X survive the Bitefront apocalypse? Maybe. Maybe not. I hope they do, because if Kiwi X gets patched, basically all free exploits will be patched. So, yeah, I'm quite concerned. So that part may or not be a little concerning to you. All right, gamers, stay civilized. Don't become savage apes. And yeah, bye.